Hi! If you frequent this channel, it's most likely for the stories of Navis Gain series, but I also work really hard on the other videos, so like, if you want to watch those as well, that'd be super cool. Boy, do I have a surprise for you! Some of you may have noticed lately that the stories of Navis Gain series have become a bit less... frequent. The truth is, they definitely have. Not because I'm running out of ideas or I'm not enjoying making them anymore, the actual reason is way cooler. We're making a movie. To make a very, very long story short, I've been working with this guy and this guy, yeah, right about there is fine, and a whole bunch of other really wonderfully talented people on a project that I think all of you are going to love. That, that's also the reason for all this mess. I, I, needed, I needed a lot of stuff. We've got some really amazing voice actors, some very talented editors and animators. We've got people who know their stuff when it comes to making a movie and when it comes to Seven Days to Die. The point is, I really think this is going to be amazing, and it's coming this fall-ish. Fall. We're going with fall. <laughs> At least that's what we're aiming for. We're, it'll probably happen, but, you know, we're making a movie, so. But I'm not just going to leave you with this announcement, and you can also probably see that the video is a little bit longer. So in just a moment here, I'm going to show you a trailer we recently wrapped up for the movie. Or you can just head over to the Green Squad channel and knock out two birds with one stone. There's going to be a link in the top right corner right now. You can go there and subscribe and watch the trailer. That's where the movie's going to be posted. I'll give you just another moment. Prolonged eye contact. Prolonged eye contact. All right, without further ado, we sincerely hope you enjoy. The following preview has not been rated. Viewer discretion is advised. My name is Razor Green. Welcome to the end of the world. There's been a lot going on lately, and you're forgiven if you haven't been watching the news, so let me catch you up on the headlines. 2011. North Korea launches an all-out assault on the states, not with bombs and bullets, but with bullshit. They fire off propaganda like bottle rockets on the 4th of July. Behind closed doors, Russia offers to help by staging a false flag attack on Korean soil that they can then blame on the US, but by the end of the day, Pyongyang is a pile of gullible, radioactive rubble. Russia claims they've saved the world by taking out a loose cannon, but nobody's really buying that. Our cowboy president starts pumping off nukes like he's firing them from a six-shooter. A billion die in the first 48 hours. A billion more in the weeks that follow. But to quote either Gloria Gaynor or Ian Malcolm, we survive. Life finds a way. After a bit, we even get parts of the internet back online. And as soon as we do, it's buzzing with rumors of a sickness. It spreads like wildfire. People who have had it the longest begin to act erratically, violently even. Research into Akir is almost immediately sidelined as we're hit with the largest sun flare in recorded history. The grid is already in tatters and the damage is near total. Plants melt down all over the world. Millions die from exposure. No power means no pumps, and when the water runs out, it's every man for himself. The virus seems like it's mutating, almost evolving before our eyes. New symptoms emerge, new adaptations and enhancements. It makes them even deadlier. If we have any hope about living our mistakes, we need a way to stop them. I'm headed to Evergreen now. I know we'd started research into, what, a cure? Hell, I'd take a zombie repellent spray at this point. Cohen, I know we're not on the best of terms right now, but if anyone finds this recording, I hope it's you. I need your help, buddy. Don't worry, Riser. I'm coming. The world's ended more times than I can count, and now it's not even safe in my own house anymore. But you're out there, somewhere, and I'm gonna find you. I don't know if you think you're gonna save the world or what, but I guess I'm not gonna let you do it alone. I don't know what's out there, I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I will find you. And I'm gonna kick your ass for sending me on this goose chase. I very much hope that got you guys as excited as I am. I have been so ecstatic to be a part of this project. Uh, if it does, 
please head over to the channel. Uh, there will be a link in the top right corner still if you haven't already clicked it. But that's where the trailer was originally posted and where the movie and a whole bunch of other relevant stuff like shorts and behind the scenes stuff will be posted in the future. Before the video ends, I do really want to drive this last point home. In case you do enjoy the stories of Navi's Gain series, but you're not quite sold on subscribing to Green Squad just yet, just know that I am taking creative lead on the majority of the project. I'm talking the writing, the direction, I'll be there for all of the gathering of footage, uh, I'm doing the editing, most of the editing for the movie, so seriously, if you're here, you should head over there too. You should head over there too. That's what I meant to say, I don't think it came out that way. So hopefully that answers a couple of questions that I've seen in the comments recently about the direction of this channel, and hopefully you guys are as excited as I am about this project. Of course, I will continue to post weekly on this channel as I have committed to, but I'll be very busy over at Green Squad as well, so I look forward to seeing you guys more on both of these channels.